Hello YouTubers, subscribers, and friends. It's 6 p.m. Monday. Uh, what is the date? The 24th? There's the moon. It's not going to focus. Got to go to the airport pick up my wife's uncle. He's coming in from Hong Kong. I don't like driving at night, so... You can see the sun is setting. And it's really dark out here where I live. Get all my lights on. Gotta go get me some grindage. I'm hungry. Somebody has got Christmas lights up already. It's not even Thanksgiving yet. Look at that. Every year I put up Christmas lights and nobody in my neighborhood, none of my neighbors ever put up Christmas lights. And now, there must be a new tenant that lives over there. Now, they got Christmas lights over there. Not even Thanksgiving yet. Alright, well, I'll film more later. It's gonna be a, a night video. I haven't done one of these in a long time. Wish I had my old Sony camera because I could really zoom into that moon. Let's see if I can zoom in on there. It says 62 degrees. Uh, I'm gonna reset my mileage here to zero. Let's see just how many miles it is to the airport. My wife's asking me. I said, I have no idea. Set it to zero. Got the heater blaring on high. And there we go. Got some lights. I haven't driven in the dark in such a long time. I don't even know how to operate my truck. 602. See how long it takes us to get there, too. Gotta give me something to eat. I'm starving. This guy in front of us, I think he's drunk. That's why I don't like driving at night. He all, uh, keeps going left and right. He went into the other lane, to the left. When he made a right turn to come onto this road, he took forever to make a right turn. It's like he was like really focusing himself to make that turn. Okay, he's going over the white line. There's a curve right up here too, a big curve. And a big ditch. Stay back a little bit. It's a nighttime video. Whoa. He's going yellow to right, yellow to right. Look at him. He's gotta be, gotta be toast as man. It's a big curb here too. I always end up behind the drunks or the text people texting or something. There he goes, going over the white line, going and get ready to go in the dirt. He's really focusing on this curb. There's a lot of bumps on this road too. The cops like to sit over here in the dark on the side of the road too. State troopers. I just have a feeling when I stop filming, he's going to do something, go off the road or something. There he goes. He went to the. I hope I'm filming it because I, I, I'm not watching the camera, I'm just pointing the camera to where he's at. Let me stop for a little bit. Well, we're gonna go eat some Chinese buffet because now Uncle Tony has delayed. This guy just went off the road and came back on. I didn't have the camera on. He went off to the right. There he goes again. Uh, he's right in the white line. He's been weaving so bad. There he goes again. White line. So we're going to go to the Chinese buffet, go get some dinner, kill some time. Uncle Tony's being delayed. He came from Hong Kong to where? L.A.? And then in L.A. they flew to Dallas? That's crazy. They flew over Arizona, go to Dallas, and then he's got to come back. That's, that's crazy. Well, that's like one time they we flew to Las Vegas and they flew us to Colorado first and then 
Las Vegas. I don't know if this guy is texting or he's drunk. Or both. Yeah, or, yeah, or both. Maybe he's drunk texting. How many times I gotta tell you I love you? I don't want to get beside him because he's drunk. I think he's drunk. I think he's both. Oh, he's, he made it to Safeway. Let's just make sure he turns before I pass. There he goes. Well, he's going to go get some more beer. That's what he's going to do. 628, 11.8 miles to the Chinese buffet. We have to kill some time because Uncle Tony is going to be delayed an hour. So we come to Newtown Buffet up here on Cortero and I-10. It has some Chinese food. Eat some wonton soup. Egg drop soup. His uh, wife is getting a scratchy throat. Asian cuisine. And then right next door is a steakhouse. Get Texas Steakhouse, something like that. There's the interstate. This is a nighttime vlog. We haven't eaten here in a long time. Cracker Barrel. I ate their Cracker Barrel, I don't know, about six months ago, my first time. I don't like it. It's old folk food. Let's go ahead and get us some Chinese buffet. So I just have to get a little bit at a time. Just a little bit of everything, like the crab puff, fried rice, beef, green beans, and other green beans. What kind of beef here, chicken, spicy, orange chicken, potato, mushroom, breaded chicken, and some one ton soup and iced tea. First round. Alright, it's dessert time. I had two big helpings of food, now dessert. Pineapple, and then this is peaches and marshmallows, watermelon, chocolate cake, and I don't know what that is, swirl cake. Getting my grindage on. What do you got? Cinnamon roll. My daughter has cinnamon roll or whatever that is. Jelly roll, whatever it is. Gotta kill time. Uncle Tony's gonna be late at the airport. Eight o'clock. We're about five minutes from the airport. Stop at the Dollar Tree because we still got an hour before Uncle Tony's plane comes in. Should have been here at 6.30. But, uh, I don't know what problems, delay or something. So my wife wants to go shopping. After the Chinese buffet, we went to uh, Sprouts. Got some sinus drops, natural herbal drops for sinus. My wife's having a sinus attack or whatever you call it. And uh, killing some time. Here at the airport, 34.6 miles. It's 821. Uh-oh, which one? On the right, you're on the right track. Hourly. I said kiss and I haven't been here in a long time. Have we been here before? Oh yeah, when we I take a number one with the large fries. Where's the button? Oh. <laughs> and then? No and then. I take the wonton soup, the fried rice, the cookies fortune. And then? And then one? No, and then! And then one ice cream, please. Tucson Airport. International Airport. What he said. I saw an airplane with the second story. It's the smallest airport I've ever been to. But it's expensive. It's I mean, expensive. when we were in uh, Korea, that was a huge airport. Yeah, yeah Korea. Everything in Korea is huge. Even the breakfast, man. It costs $99 for a family of four to have eggs, toast, and uh, hash browns. Why is it so dusty on my 
All right, let me focus on parking. I'll feel smart. This is one cool Hummer. I almost bought a Hummer. One just like this. But uh, I ended up buying a house in Florida, Cocoa Beach instead. This is one cool Hummer. We're at the airport getting ready to go inside. Tucson International Airport. I think he comes on American Airlines. This is late for us. We don't never come out at night. Once the sun sets, we never leave the house. It's been a long time since me and my family have been out late. American. You said American, right? Yeah. Customs. American A gates. Oh, there's a popo. I wonder if you can film around the airport. I don't know if you're allowed to record in airports or not. There's what? Oh, this is where he's going to come down right here? Yeah. It's the empty airport. I'm not used to seeing airports. It's empty. Well, we're here at the airport. We're waiting for him. He should be here 25 minutes. Let's check out these boots. Skin boots. Right, Arizona boots. Well, there you have it. This has been a night vlog on a trip to the airport. Pick up my wife's uncle Tony. And we got 25 minutes to kill. There you have it. This is the most emptiest airport I've ever seen. Ever. And I've been to a lot of them. This is the smallest and the most emptiest. I'll end it on that. And uh, thanks for taking the time to watch my videos. I'm getting gone.